uh, because it's, so it was our first and we knew that the patient was slightly complicated but everything went very well. We're happy. Slightly complicated? What do you mean? That is a guy who had a previous trauma and was operated before and it was not successful. So we expected that it would be a little bit difficult but we are extremely happy to end well. And after operating Doc, how long does it take before the, the patient gets his hearing his, his or her hearing back? Is it immediate or does it take a bit of time? It is immediate, but because we are going to be putting some bandages, so at least after a uh, two weeks, uh, that's when we remove the bandages and then you can tell that there's a bit of a difference. But usually it's immediate, yeah. Can you speak about sorry, speak about the new prospectus of this technology that you just put in there? How is it gonna help millions of South Africans? It's going to help the million of South Africa because it's a new technology, it's a new development, and uh, which can be used in any patient. So if we sometimes if we take a CT scan or an X-ray of your brain, we can see the bones that are damaged and recreate them exactly as they are. So it will help a lot, and it will be affordable. So that's why we wanted to do it here in the state hospital to be able to help our people. Talking about affordability, how much do you think it will cost? At the moment, it won't be different from because we get all our um, uh, processes from overseas, so it will depend on the rate of exchange, but it's going to be on the same uh, rate of prices, but it will be developing them in the country. Because the guys that are moving.